I am Chalfant, and this is Chalfant TV. My selfie is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's good! What's up, everybody? I'm Chalfant, and welcome to Chalfant TV. I'm an educator and school principal, and on this channel, we dive deep into BTS. And I post videos at the same time every day. I've been learning so much about Yoongi ever since his birthday, and today I'm going to react to one more of his solo tracks called First Love from the Wings album. I'll start with the music video. There's also a video of Suga playing the piano. There's a live performance, and I'll probably re-watch the music video with the closed captioning on as well. So I'm going to start by watching the music video for First Love. ways in which God can make us slowly and lead us back to ourselves. This was the way he dealt with me at that time. Tied to the universe, I guess. Do anything to get to your first love? So cinematic. I know he's gonna rap. I love the harmony of this already. Violin. I'd forgotten the short films that are tied to the universe don't actually have the music in it, or at least not a lot of it. But it was still good to be able to see it anyway. So now I'm going to watch a lyric video for First Love. Goodbye. 
It's a weird feeling. I'm feeling like emotional because although he's talking about the piano, you know, in a lot of ways, I feel like I'm able to make connections with other things and other people. And honestly, I'm a sucker for love songs. But I also have this other side of me that loves rap as well. So I think just so you are prepared, once I do get into more of the vocal lines music, it's probably going to be way up my alley, I think. <laughs> I really like that song a lot. I think while he's specifically talking about the piano, he's also talking about music. Always having that sense of reliability and that passion for music is always there. And if anything's ever going wrong, that is where he can go. And we know he does do that. He made it clear how he can create songs, you know, each and every day. So now I'm going to watch a video of him playing the piano. It's like he's playing it for feel, you know, and to listen to it, hear it out. You know, I really think about the vulnerability that it takes, you know, for him to be able to do that or somebody who produces music so well to kind of open up that other side of them, you know, when he's like literally practicing what looks like the chorus part of Kuki's Begin song and how he's saying, I don't remember it. But just to be able to be yourself in front of the camera and show your, I don't want to say flaws, but you know, you're practicing in front of other people with mistakes and all of these things too. I think that's a great characteristic to have, you know, because not a lot of people would want to do that. So I'm going to watch a live performance. I think 
what's really beautiful about their music is that it has always actually been about them. And I feel like that sometimes is a rare thing in music. And I'm not somebody who knows a whole lot about music anyway, but I feel like it's never truly about the person singing it. And I think some of that comes from the fact that they write a lot of their own music as well. Love being able to see them perform live, especially the rap line, because you can just see and feel the emotion in the lyrics and just the performance of all of it, and it was good. So if I'm not mistaken, I'll be diving into his first mixtape, August D, next. So stay tuned. And if you're still here with me, go ahead and crush that like button for this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on those notifications so that you're alerted to when new videos come out. Thanks for joining me. I am Chalfont, and this is Chalfont TV. And as Jimin says, you nice, keep going.